Hey everyone, it's Geocaching with the Bent and Gross. And today we are doing the Geo Challenge of the Month. Now the Geo Challenge of the Month is from Cache Advance and this month it is to find a virtual cache. So, I don't know if you can see behind me. We're in a graveyard, but it's not just any graveyard. It is a soldier's graveyard. This is where soldiers who have been killed in battle or killed while in service are buried. I actually have two relatives here and I'll show you their graves afterwards. But right now, it's starting to rain, so I'm gonna try to outrun the rain and try to get this video done. So see you soon. Okay, I don't know if you can tell, but it is raining, and I am now on Main Street, so you'll see cars pass me. They're probably wondering what I'm doing. Um, so we're at a place called Stone Remembrance, and I have to find, in this location, What is the stone? What is in the stone at this location? I think I see it. It's on the stone wall. It's really cool. And I saw it when I came in and I didn't know that that was the thing. That was the answer. So I'm gonna take a picture and show it to the cash owner and then we're gonna to try to find another one. So see you soon. Okay, I am back by the car. Back by the car, I'm very soaking wet. Um, it's still raining, so we're going to wait out the rain for a little bit, and then I think I'm going to show you where my relatives' graves are. Alright, so here is my grandfather's cousin's grave in this cemetery. And here is my grandfather's other cousin, Donald. Glessner and William Glessner were brothers. They didn't die on the same day. They didn't die in the same year. But. Okay, so I am back in the car and I turned on the camera because I wanted to tell you a story about what happened when we first got to this graveyard. Um, we pulled in and I was trying to bring up the cash details on my phone and my phone just kept going crazy uh, the screen would come down like the menu the menu just kept coming down on my on my phone no matter how many times I put it back up it just kept coming down and then so finally it just it stayed up but it was just it was up there at the top like hello I'm still here even though I'm not coming down it was really really crazy I had to restart my phone and then it worked fine but it just it was just really weird showing up to this grave site this this graveyard and then my phone starts acting all crazy so kind of an a weird story i thought i'd share okay i don't know if you can see it in the sky or not it's a little light but there is a rainbow in the sky Can you see it behind me? See the rainbow? So I'm standing here at a monument at still at the Antigua Battlefield. And we're at virtual cache number two. It's called the Coffee Boy. I have to find out who the monument is dedicated to and how the person on the monument got their nickname. And just like that, the rainbow has almost disappeared. So, um, yep, so two virtual caches done in one day for the Geo Challenge of the Month for August 2018. They are getting ready to renovate this bridge. Burnside Bridge. I don't think you can see it, but on that yield sign, there is a blue jay, and he keeps flying from the sign to the grass, back to the sign. 
wonder if he'll do it. Did you see it? Now he's on the yellow side. This grass. Water droplets. See the bridge? There is the bridge. You can't really see it. Not sure if we can get a better view, but okay. It has been raining today, so these stones are wet. But one of the stones kind of looks like a heart. Well, I feel like this is probably going to be a short video because it didn't take us that long to find these caches this time. So, wonderful caches, loved both of them. Very awesome locations at the Antietam Battlefield. Good history, I always love coming here. Um, so, thank you to the two people who put these virtual caches out. Thank you for bringing us to the areas that you did. And uh, I hope if you're watching, you enjoy these videos. But anyways, thank you for watching. Comment down below if you've ever found these caches or if you've ever been to um, either Antietam or Gettysburg battlefields, any battlefields. And uh, thank you for watching. If you liked this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't. We will see you all next time. Bye. This was the purpose of Burnside Bridge. And this is who... Burnside Bridge is named for Ambrose Burnside.